The Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints requires priesthood authority to act in the Lord's name and administer His Church. It is an article of faith that the giving or transfer of authority must be done by prophecy, by the laying on of hands, and by those in authority. Curiously, the Lord does not prescribe the manner of ordaining or giving priesthood authority in our modern revelations. The Doctrine and Covenants mentions the laying on of hands numerous times, but all within the context of the gift of the Holy Ghost, administering to the sick, and the blessing of children. Not once is the laying on of hands for the conferring of priesthood authority or ordaining to priesthood office found in the revelations. The Church's Handbook 2, Administering the Church, does not cite any scriptural references to support the laying on of hands to confer priesthood authority. So where did the idea come from that the conferral of priesthood authority must be done by the laying on of hands? There is, however, an example in Latter-day Scripture where priesthood authority is conferred by the laying on of hands, which may well serve as the original model after which the ordinance was instituted. This form of giving priesthood authority is consistent with how the Nephites perform the ordinance in the Book of Mormon. Moroni was even more explicit, giving the complete form of the ordinance in his day. The laying on of hands to give priesthood authority is also consistent with the laying on of hands for the gift of the Holy Ghost. It is, after all, the Holy Ghost that gives priesthood authority and the power by which priesthood ordinations must take place. Given the absence of a prescribed form from the Lord in this dispensation, we can only assume that the ordinance conferring both priesthood authority and office should have the following elements based upon the historical precedents just cited. As we documented in a previous episode, the ordinance of confirmation followed the same pattern. This pattern is not coincidental. When a new member receives the gift of the Holy Ghost through the laying on of hands, he or she is also receiving an ordination to the office of member in the Aaronic Priesthood. <laughs> 